The acting force commander visited the Halgan forward operation base in Hiran region a day after troops from the Ethiopian National Defense thwarted a dawn raid by Al-Shabaab killing more than 100 militants. Major General Nakibas Lakara commended the sector's four troops for their resilience saying Al-Shabaab has been exploiting Amison's weaknesses but the force is now a step ahead owing to intelligence sharing among all sectors that form the forces. Let me congratulate uh, Colonel Ayenum and the troops for doing a very commendable job. We have learned lessons from previous uh, attacks and Al-Shabaab has been you know, exploiting uh, some weaknesses but over time now we have been able to learn lessons and share the experiences. I think this is evidence of our troops being able to pick those lessons. Apart from the killing of more than 100 Al-Shabaab fighters, the Ethiopian contingent managed to recover an assortment of weapons, among them rocket-propelled grenades, AK-47 rifles, handheld radios, and anti-aircraft guns. Sector 4 Deputy Commander Colonel Ayenom Mefisin say the militant group had intended to overrun the base but found Amison soldiers more than ready to battle, forcing the terrorists to flee after suffering major casualties in the fighting that lasted more than four hours. We have come a long way really and we shall continue to ensure that those weaknesses are addressed. So the troops have done a very commendable job. The attack comes months after a similar attack was launched against a Kenyan base in El Ade by Al-Shabaab.